Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of The Binding of Isaac. We're gonna do our first daily run here. Uh, this is the first one I've ever attempted, no proof. I, I didn't lose, you lost. We got a Lazarus run, with a shot speed up pill apparently, and a fly. This is uh, not a fantastic start. You know, the fly is, is not good. But it's, I guess, not the worst thing we could have gotten. Because it will occasionally damage stuff. Please don't touch me. And then... And we have... We should probably try to kill ourselves as often as possible. Well, once per floor at least. <sighs> you now get a pretty alright damage up each time you die as Lazarus that persists between floors. You just need to- oh, you also get a new life every floor. That didn't used to happen in Afterbirth Plus. Only if you lose the, the life you had will you get a new life, though. Thank you for the bombs. And I'm gonna guess that this is right here. I was wrong. Well, I have enough bombs that I can check, like, all of the possible locations. Uh, Secret room might be to the right, or it might be... Nope, sick rooms to the right. And cool, we got more bombs from it. And the other secret room is straight up. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess this could be where I kill myself. Oh shit, nice. Oh no, I died. Plus 2.7 damage, goddamn. Image. So I guess I'm just bleeding everywhere now. Should I grab the starter deck? Maybe. Maybe, maybe. There is a reason. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. There's a lot of really strong cards I can get from this. Emperor is not one of them. Well, it could be. Emperor is not bad. This is hard on the ground. I'm gonna go to the curse room. I need water. Is that the, the blue baby soul? It is. Oh, I can hold two. Right, starter deck. I just bought that. I don't think this one's that good. I'm still gonna use it on the boss, because why not? Yeah, well, I mean, it made me take damage, but there's a heart on the ground, so I don't mind. <laughs> Got blown into me. Uh, I'm gonna take the bone heart first, and then cover it, and then take the soul heart. Maybe I should have not done that. I don't know. I just kind of want to keep the Bone Heart as an actual health upgrade rather than using it for Devil Deal protection, I think. I have a lot of bombs. I should blow up the Blood Donation Machine. Or I could use it. I guess since I picked up the Soul Heart second, I can use this, like, better. Oh shit, nice. I had to let my cat out of my room. Kind of had her locked in here with me. Uh, I don't think I really have anything else to do here. And I know I said that the Emperor card wasn't going to be very good, but I might just use it immediately, or after I go in here. Oh my god. Alright, uh, run's guaranteed. I know I just took extra damage there for no reason, but... The run is guaranteed. <laughs> I will not lose this. Mark my words, this is, this is a one run. Especially if it gives me easy bosses like this one. See, the fly was actually kind of nice there, I'm not even going to lie. Also, eye drops is good. I have health for double deals, and I'm trying to kill myself intentionally each floor anyway. I don't I don't really want to do that this floor, honestly, but maybe. Uh, the shovel and death's list are two items that I don't like, which is why I'm buying both. And I'm going in this, no, I shouldn't do the crawl space in here because I won't be able to come back to it if there's something that I want to come back to. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. 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 I'm gonna leave that soul heart on the ground, and I'm gonna kill myself. I know I have a lot of health right now, but I think stats are kind of more important than health in the long term. Is this the trapdoor? It might be, or the crawl space, not the trapdoor. It's obviously a trapdoor. It is the crawl space. Sex. 
Oh my god, it's a black market. Well, uh, remember what I said about this being a one run? Yeah. Uh, okay, I'm gonna kill myself in here. I'm gonna take Habit. I'm gonna take... I don't really want Pandora's box, honestly. I'm gonna take the Piggy Bank. And... Maybe I can find some other way to get rid of these black hearts, because I really don't care about the Pandora's box. Actually, maybe I do. I'm gonna look up what it gives me on Basement 2. Two bombs and two keys. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> That's not good. Um, hmm. I guess it's not terrible when I need to die anyway. Oh man, I don't know. I'm gonna wait and see if there's something else I could spend my black arts on, like a double beggar or something. Forgot I was right next to the shop in the item room. Take the card. Moon. Sure. Cool. More change. Thank you, sir. What do you have for me? Oh my god, are you serious? This is the easiest run I've ever played. This is insane. <laughs> It's also probably not the easiest run, but goddamn is it close. This is insanity. Okay, another soul heart for when I die. Maybe I should be trying to go for death list. I actually kind of forgot I had that. Oh! Death list just kind of gave me a soul heart there. Uh, alright. I appreciate it. That's really good. Okay. <laughs> this is like the most impossible death list I've ever seen. Well, maybe, maybe it's not too bad. Just gotta, like, single out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you, Holy Light. Shoop da whoop. Larg. We've got a room of enemies. My favorite. We do need to find the, uh, super secret room. Did that Holy Light shot damage the fatties from that distance? That's what it looked like. That can't be, though, right? That's crazy. Okay, super secret room is off of the big room. So it can't be here. Could be here. Could be... Where's the door? Could be here. Could be... Where's the door? <laughs> Could be here. Fuck. Okay, so it... I think it actually has to be... Well, if this is that much in, so it'd be like here. I guess like here? Fuck. Okay, maybe I'll go grab Pandora's box since I was stupid with all of my bombs. Although, I was kind of doing that on purpose since I knew that I had more to get. Just kind of waiting there. There's no reason for me to not grab Pandora's box right now. Like, I want to die. There's so hard from the ground. It's, it's perfect. Plus three damage from picking that up. Look at that. Uh, let's use it. Could have saved it, but I think the crawl spaces are going to be a little more helpful. We got a red heart back, which is kind of cool, actually. I could grab this rotten heart. I'm not going to, but I could. We left three soul hearts on the ground, which is really good. All right, time to go steamroll the game. 6.45 damage starting out here. Pretty good. I want to get Death's List off. No reason to- Whoa, not to this in this room. Fuck you. It was really hard to dot wall. It wasn't hard to dodge, you just timed it really well. Thank you. Um... I don't know where I would use the... Shovel in here. Thank you. Ace of Spades, that's good. Oh, what? That's awesome. I think this is crawl space? Yeah. Reward or Nancy bombs? Did I get a range up from killing that guy? From Death List? That's alright, I guess. I think this guy has pretty low range as a character. Oh, Death List. Shit. Also, maybe Accuracy's power is going to make Death List easier, or harder, depending on how you look at it. Probably easier, though, apparently. Yeah! Oh, I thought... For some reason, I thought that was the boss room. Uh, more curse rooms. 
maybe pass. I don't really care. Oh. Eh, fuck it, I'll grab it. Maybe I'll get, like, Flight or something, and Curse Rooms will be a little bit more accessible. Still have a lot of money left over from that. Button. That's an easy room. Oh, Death List works automatically in rooms that don't have enemies, apparently. Or, I mean, like, rooms that don't have enemies but still have a solution you need to do. We got a Tears upgrade? Suck my dick, that's awesome. Would the trapdoor clo- oh, well. I was gonna see if I can make a, a second crawl space and escape this room with it somehow. You, uh, you can't do that. Or maybe you can and I don't know how to do it. Hey, poop guys. What if I, like, baited an enemy to fall down the trapdoor? <laughs> they should make that possible. Sup, keys? Uh, secret room? Yeah, whoa. I got scatter bombs from Nancy Bombs. I actually got scatter poison hot bombs from Nancy Bombs there. This is useless. No reason it's not death listed up here. Boom. Soul Heart. Let's go. Okay. You're kind of redeeming myself. What? You're kind of redeeming yourself in my eyes, death list. Uh, I guess I'll grab the charges that I left in here. And then I'll go. Mega Ball. I'll just use the strength here. Oh my god, I gained 13.91 damage or some shit because of the uh, accuracy of power. Luck up. Double deal. Should I take the health upgrade now? Probably. I lost it when I went in here because of strength. I forgot about that. Vengeful Spirit? Not that good. Um, I think, honestly. Ow. But. I had red health to spare, so whatever. Let's go to the next floor. Get a new crawl space. Get new items. What the hell is this? Uh, spider bite for free? Well, kind of for free. So is the uh, is the crawl space generated by the shovel like the same one that you would find just by destroying a rock somewhere in the floor? Oh god, I almost walked back into that. Vault. Oh, I almost fucked up my death list. Don't you dare fly! Oh, you piece of garbage, Blackheart. <laughs> that was a that was a terrible combination right there in that room. I'll take this. I think this would actually reveal tinted rocks. I mean, crawl spaces also tinted rocks, which is why I'm taking it. Kill all the poops in the correct order. I got a soul heart from doing this room last time. Come on, fly. There you go, bud. Oh, nah, nah, nah. A bomb. My cat's back. <laughs> Hi. Nope. No, it's not worth taking damage to try to get Deathless to happen. Unless that happens, I guess, but sh shut up. Oh, I actually got the Deathless one. Nice. Ooh, charge key. Is there an active item in here that that would actually be helpful for? No. <laughs> There's an active item, but just not one it would be helpful for. Another Ace of Spades. That's kind of interesting. Secret room? I got a ghost bomb from that. Double room clear. Oh, yeah, because I have the, uh, the there's options question mark thing. I'm going to take the card. I was a genius for doing that. Whoops, picked up the charge key. Just, nah, I'm not gonna get another active item anyway, probably. Who cares? So does that does death does death's list why is that hard to say? Does death's list always start with the wow, the top left enemy in the room? Oh, I forgot that was ugh, god damn it. I'm not really gonna be able to kill myself for the extra damage this floor is since I have so many soul hearts I don't want to get rid of. I mean, whatever. I have so many good items at this point, I don't think I need the uh, extra damage ups. You only really need to do that until a certain point, I guess. We uh, did not find our treasure room yet. There it is. Oh no, no way, I'm actually going to do the death list there. <laughs> I didn't think that was going to work. I got a soul heart from Justice. That's pretty pog. Um, I, 
really don't like you, but I'll take you. I got tears down, damage up. All right, I can deal with that, I guess. It's not the worst fire rate in the world. Uh, I guess I'll pop. Oh, uh, no, I'm going to keep the sun for the next floor. I'm just going to blow this up because I don't care. I'm going to go find the secret room now, which I think is probably somewhere. Right here? Right here? Well, I could have verified that that wasn't where it was, where it was beforehand. Right here? I guess it could be below the boss area, like right here. Yeah, okay. That took me longer than it should have. A stone chest from a... Alright, it's kind of weird. Was that a golden bomb from Nancy Bombs? That doesn't even make sense. Uh, is Crystal Key the occasional red door opening? There's a lot of key trinkets, and they're, not that they're too similar really to each other, but they're all keys, and it gets confusing. There's like the blue key and the strange key, which look basically the same because they're both just blue keys. And then there's like this key, the Crystal Key. There's the there's the gilded key. It's a mess. I'm gonna go into at least one curse room. Got a soul heart out of it, worth it. Got full health out of it, even more worth it. Alright. Maybe I'll go in the other one too, since that one was so good. Just gave me health. Uh, ooh, I almost failed deathless there. Not quite the... Got a nickel out of it. Hell yeah. And we restored our health again before leaving. Perfect. That's a wall. Feeling good about this one. Oh, we have the piggy bank. That's overpowered. I'm rich. Mega, whoops, mega fatty. That was fucking easy. Did I get a troll bomb from Death's List? That is quite trolly. Black heart. So hard to fill the black heart, I guess. It's not what I expected to happen there. We didn't get the devil deal, which is fine. We don't need it. Next floor. Oh god, both of the curse rooms are right here. This is a very compact floor. I've been in two rooms and I can see four special rooms. Challenge dice and two curse rooms. I can't kill that guy until I kill the other guys, that's right. <laughs> well, that's just a health upgrade sitting on the... I forgot about that item, I'm a dumbass. I'm gonna go down here. I don't know why I put this in the challenge room, but shut up. Uh. That item is really risky to take, because he blows up all over the place. Which is why I'm taking him. Hey guys, bye guys, I don't think fighting you. What? Oh, I opened a red room! Oh! Where did that card come from? Ace of Diamonds just got- I opened another one! <laughs> oh my goodness. This is my favorite item I've ever had. Thank you, Crystal Key. What happened if I would have, like, just touched that red heart, even though I couldn't have taken it? Marked. You know, not really the coolest thing I could have gotten from the Ultra Seek Room. In fact, I'm going to come back later and see if I can get a reroll for that. But I will take it if it's the only thing I can get, because Marked is still pretty good. I just... I mean, come on, you can get, like, Angel deal items in there. I've gotten Revelation in there. Ow, shit. Hmm. I think, actually, my first Ultra Seek Room ever gave me Revelation. Like, right when Repentance came out. Whoa! Aw, oh, damn it! I thought that was gonna be a per throw. I was about to flip my shit. Well, actually, this does tell me where the, uh... Oh, wait! Does this tell me where the Ultra Secret Room is? I might have to keep this to the next floor. Rune of Ansu's does not reveal the Ultra Secret Room. Fuck. Well, it does reveal the Super, so I should just use it here, I guess. And Suz, not and Suz. I don't know why I said and Suz. Please stay away. Okay, good. What? Did I just kill the mask with holy light? Okay, here's my opportunity to test this. Oh, you can push both of them. Whoa. I can even separate them. But if I take the bomb, the heart disappears. 
What, ha what would have happened if I left the room? This is also a weird way to find my uh, super secret room. Going into an adjacent room that wasn't even actually there. Holy shit, he launched that thing. Also, key or golden bomb. <laughs> Alright. Uh, so this ultra secret room, I mean super secret room, is supposed to be filled with pills. But I have the starter deck, so it turned it overpowered. <laughs> High priestess, hangman, strength question mark, hangman question mark. I think hangman question mark is the greed transformation and strength is the enemy weakener. So I'm going to do the greed transformation now and then grab strength and keep it for something else. Or maybe I'll grab Soul of Judas and use it in the curse room afterwards. Ah shit, grab it. I am the keeper. I could go fight the boss with triple shot here. Not a terrible idea. Hi, Bloat. Fuck you. You're dead. Thanks for the money. Draw more. Damn it. Wow, that's garbage. I'm still the keeper for like a minute or whatever, so if I can get up there and uh, do some damage to enemies, more importantly, kill them. Damn it, I lost it. Yeah, if you kill enemies during the keeper transformation from that card, they drop money, as if you're applying Tainted Keeper. I actually don't think it disappears like Tainted Keeper money does, but it, it is uh, similar in one sense. He says as he picks up one cent. Whoa. I just fucking thought I dodged that, and then I just like walked back into the middle and got hit by it. I ran into that spider. I'm playing terribly. I'm gonna die. Help. Ooh, pinky shears. Uh, maybe. Did I already do the crawl space on this floor? I did. Golden poopy. I apparently ignored a dice room at some point. Is it possible to get Death's List to work in rooms with those enemies? <laughs> Good job. Oh yeah, the Eternal Heart Room. Why not? D20 for just this room? At least there's bombs in here. I mean, pots. Uh, wow, I tried to get to a more helpful position so I could go bomb the other pot and I got myself damaged. Useless dumb. <laughs> well, cool, I get to reroll one thing in here. Nice. I'm going in the curse rooms. I don't care what you say. Oh no. Perthrow? Damn it! I really want a Perthrow. Uh, full card. Yeah, I'm just gonna use this so it take less damage overall here. Can you stop with the troll bombs? I said, can you stop? Uh, Ace of Clubs. Another troll bomb. Holy shit. Wish I went in this one first so I could have had free entry to the other one. Then it could have fooled out, but... <sighs> Hindsight. Oh, fucking dumbass. I can just do this. That was the whole point of bringing that. You guys want to be bombs? I want this. Yeah, I needed more bombs game, thank you. Jesus. Can I get a Perthra room? Or a game kid? <laughs> that's actually not the game kid, that's the cartridge. Oh no. Still have Deathless going on, never mind. Whoa, hi. A rainbow poopy and a golden poopy. I am at max money now. Chariot card. That's better than two of clubs. I guess I'll just pop the two of clubs then, huh? Oh, I didn't go in the shop yet with full money. Crooked Penny? What if I Crooked Penny marked? <laughs> I would get extra stat bonus. It would be kind of dumb because I would be potentially losing out on something that I don't need to lose out on. But. It's also kind of funny, you know. This is the this is the funny man play, and if it, if it pays out, it pays out, right? Like we're gonna get some nice stats from it. Oh boy, here we go. God damn it! <laughs> I knew it was gonna happen too. It's fine. 
Should I keep Crooked Penny for memes, or is it is it smarter to still go with the shovel? If I keep the Crooked Penny, I could duplicate the items in Boss Rush. I can't make it to Boss Rush. What the hell am I talking about? Shovel time. Library. Satanic Bible. Oh, actually. I guess I can just pop this with Reckless Abandon since uh, the mom fight can't pay out with the double deal item. What What if it just made me take the uh, Polaroid of the negative but for a fucking health instead of for free? Cracked Orb. What does that do? Is that the one that, like, you take damage and sometimes opens, like, doors? Oh, you know what? I already have the crawlspace open this floor. I'm taking the Bible so I can... Can I grab it? What the actual fuck? <laughs> taking the Bible so I can get some extra... Oh. <laughs> Some extra black hearts. I was afraid that the bomb fly was gonna touch that poop enemy and then do like a bomber boy blast. It's happened before. God! <laughs> Alright. Uh, maybe I should have waited until I went in there to use that so I wouldn't have to spend a black heart on here, but whatever, I'm already committed. God damn it. What? Oh, that dude! That revealed a secret room and showed me where my ultra is. That's. That's broken. Thank you, Cracked Orb, but I just am trying not to take damage right now, so stop activating. Um, well, I guess I know stuff now, thanks to Cracked Orb. I'm, okay, I'm blowing you up. You're fucking annoying. Holy shit, I took so much damage on the fire. Fuck you. I hate rooms with spikes in them. Like, what the fuck are you even supposed to do about that? Well... Oh my cards. Alright, we're doing some 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 bombing here and some keying. What are you? Death. Two of clubs. Death. Strength. What about you? Magician. Uh that's pretty good. I could keep that for something. Chariot. I could use chariot and magician to kill the boss fight. What were you? Ace of Diamonds? Really don't need that. <laughs> Kind of have full money. I really need to take no damage here for a little while, at least until I find a good uh, amount of soul hearts on the ground to heal myself with after I die. If I get a soul heart payout with this item, definitely going to be taking it. I'm actually going to leave that coin on the ground in case I want it later. Helpful of Deathless to start in the top left. That actually does make it a lot easier to use. I got a damage up? from death's list maybe i think possibly that could have happened i don't know d6 holy shit um maybe uh hmm 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 i'm gonna wait until the end of the floor and then i might take the d6 uh we've already been in there okay we got more soul hearts popping up on the ground as i was saying Please die. Okay. Then you, then... Okay. Then the one that's gonna fall first. Because it went up first. And then we kill this one. And then we get a key from it, which isn't very good. Take this key, though. I got the coin. Oh my god. Thank you, Holy Light. Alright. The question is, do I die now? Since I have a charge in my Bible. So I can use that. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna go kill myself in the sacrifice room. And then I have enough soul hearts to pick up where I won't be utterly screwed. And I can always bomb all the skulls on the floor for more black hearts. I'm really just trying to like super guarantee that I won this win this run now that I said I did or I should earlier. Hello. Sup, angel boy. Guess I'll fight you. Alright. Really don't need that. Could have used the soul heart payout a lot more. That actually would have been really, really nice. Okay, do I want to fight the second angel? I might just die instead on purpose. What if I get a part throw or something? I could reroll the key pieces, and that could be really good. Oh, the d6 is on the floor. Oh, I'm gonna go get more hearts. Whoops. <laughs> Still gonna go get more hearts. It's worth it to spawn that angel and then kill it so I can get the uh, the key pieces, both of them in there, and then re-roll them. This is, this is going to work. This is going to be nice. Are there, no more, are there not any red hearts I can grab anywhere? No? Thank you. 
That was perfect. I appreciate it very much. Also gonna start bombing some of these. Wow, okay. Um, now I need to make a path over there. How do I do that? Can I do that? Might be able to do that like this. No. I might need flight to get over there. Can you maybe do like this action? Aha, okay. And then I can just, I guess I could bomb this skull like that. That wasn't really the plan there, but that works. And then I can do that. But then we gotta love this card. We can go sacrifice to the thing. And then I can teleport to my shop because I don't feel like walking. This run's going on pretty long, 35 minutes on the 6th floor. Alright, we're gonna use the lover's card, touch the spikes, pick up a heart, fight him, not die, that would be silly. Glad I did that. Let's go grab the d6. I'm dead now, so I can go ahead and uh, grab all the soul hearts. Might as well bomb all the skulls, try to get more black hearts and cards and stuff, or hosts, same thing. Got a Soul Apollyon from that one, which I'll use on the way back. Uh, Broken Modem is actually the reason I'm doing this daily challenge in the first place. You do seven of these in a row and win that from it. Soul Heart in here is great. I guess I'll grab the Nightlight, because why not? I need to get rid of my money. Buy the bag, grab the keys, buy the bomb, buy the other key. Who cares? Just spend all your money. There's so much on the ground. Dim Bulb? No. Crystal Key might still end up somehow finding me in Ultra Secret Room. Can't believe I- Ooh! Can't believe I deleted our fucking marked like that. Oh yeah, the Chariot card. Chariot Magician was the combo I was gonna do. Let's bring Soul of Apollyon in as well. Soul of Apollyon. Now we've got so many- Whoa, flies. Guess I'll grab all the money. Grab the Soul Hearts. I forgot to grab the D6 on the way. That's kind of the whole point. D6. We get Lil Spewer and Conehead. Lil Spewer is not great, but Conehead's fine. Could have looked for a battery and tried to reroll them again, but meh. Another card? Why did that spawn? Oh, oh, Lil Spewer is probably supposed to give you a card or a pill on pickup, and I couldn't do that because I have the starter deck. Oh, yeah, the Bible. They're keeping it. Hey, Delph. I really do. Not gonna take any damage on the boss, but. Still, gotta gotta be careful about this game. Red room, what the thing I don't care about. All right, we're gonna use chariot first, and if that doesn't seal the deal, I might use magician. It might be unnecessary. We have a lot of flies and stuff. I think the boss is actually just gonna die immediately. Oh yeah, that was that was pretty immediate. We got an angel deal. Didn't I take double deals? Oh, I used the Sacrifice Room. Yeah, okay. I forgot about that. Breath of Life is fucking terrible. Screw you, I should have brought the D6 in here. I could get an actual key piece to spawn, but no. Man, now I'm kind of pissed I didn't get the double deal. Whatever, charge key is nice. Decent amount of health, going on to the next floor. Just gotta stay relatively careful. The final boss for this challenge is Mom's Heart, so as long as I'm you know, good for this floor and next floor. That's it. We win. Okay, little spewer. Weird item. Doesn't seem very helpful. Holy shit, I don't even know what just happened to that guy. I'll take a key open chest for stuff. Oh, what? Uh, no. Somehow got Deathless to work there. I got shot speed out of it, which is weird. How does uh the, whoops how does the there's options question mark uh item with the room pickups how does that work pff, how does that work with contract from below would you be able to have two separate choices that uh are individual from each other <laughs> like you could choose like a like a key and a bomb shows up and then like a chest and a red heart and then, like, you could choose the chest, and then the red heart would disappear, but then the key and the bomb would still be there to freely choose from. Mm hmm That was the... Brimstone? Yeah. <laughs> Why not? 
the pact and contract from below. I mean, I have to, right? I was just talking about this. I was literally just talking about it. <laughs> oh, you fucking asshole. It, since I died in the middle of picking up the pact, I didn't get the health that I was supposed to get from it. Or did I? Wait, what? I have more health now. I don't know what just happened. Well, uh, I have brimstone and a lot of shit going on right now. I just want to go into a room and see how powerful I am real quick. Well, this is a bad room to show that off. Holy shit. <laughs> okay, well, I found out how a contract from below works. It works by just spawning extra items that you can take. That is really good. The star's question mark. Deletes the last or the, the earliest passive item and gives you two from the current item pool. I believe. Does the sun clear Curse of the Lost? No, it does not. That would be cool, though. You know it. I know Soul does. <laughs> Contract from Below is so good with this item. That's, that's crazy. Two different choices. Alright, we're heading on. No reason to drag this on any further. Final floor. We're gonna go completely destroy it with our fucking... 9.98 damage brimstone just starting off with here which honestly isn't that high but it's high enough that we're going to win oh I had to get out of the way that laser there what the hell just happened oh what i didn't kill him what the shit okay i was repaid oh and the chest disappeared golden key and golden penny from that chest pretty interesting it was a garbage golden penny though jesus lost that almost immediately Whoa! Did did Broken Modem just delete an enemy? Did did it just consider that when when these guys that guy just killed one of his friends split off of the base enemy that they came from that it was considered a projectile and then it deleted it? I'm pretty sure that just happened. I just rambled like a maniac there, but I think that just straight up deleted an enemy. Okay. Well now I know. Oh damn it! I thought I had my stars card on me. That would have been perfect. I was gonna say now I know where I'm popping my stars card, but no. Oh, Emperor card. I can, I guess, pop the Star's card in there for a boss item. Uh, yeah, I'll take Brim Bombs. It'll delete my Eternal Heart. No, it won't, but uh, it's fine. Ace of Hearts is going to have to be dropped. Oh, God. What is that? Oh. Uh. I don't think I care, right? That's not like crazy. Does it open red doors? If it opens red doors, then I can get to that ultra secret room. Opens all doors in the room. Does not open the strange door. Does not open the flesh door. I'm not seeing anything about opening red doors though. I could take it just to test. Whoops, I clicked Minecraft. Could take it just to test if it does that because I'm really curious. We don't need the Magician for the boss fight, it just would have been funny. A Joker card? What the fuck? Okay, um, Joker card. I gotta go find my Sun card. I think it's up here. You know, the only place I've been. Or not my Sun card, my Stars card. We Joker, then we Stars. We lost the Fly, and we gained Whore of Babylon and Maw of the Void. Holy shit! <laughs> that is pretty fucking strong. We got Leviathan! Alright, that's flight. We got two charge abilities now, too. Some kind of plane or something is flying over my house. Sorry if you can hear that. This is cool. We got Brimstone Mob of the Void. I like this combo. I like this combo. What is this? Ace of Hearts? Cool. Um, I'm gonna go pop Ace of Hearts in the first room I see enemies in. Oh. See so ya. Oh my goodness. Why did they both turn into soul hearts? Speaking of soul hearts. Well, I think this run is a guaranteed loss. I don't think I don't think I can win this. This is like a pretty hard game, so I don't think it's gonna happen. Okay. Moment of truth. Does the get out of jail free card open red doors? I'm going to assume it doesn't, because there's a lot of things that already do that. God damn it. It makes the golden key sound when you use it. Okay, I need to go back and grab the, uh... What was it? Like a... Reverse... Sun card? Or a reverse... There was a reverse Emperor card, and there was a reverse... 
something, right? Reverse, reverse magician, duh. Okay. Pretty garbage, but thanks. We're gonna go check out the vault. Money. Let's go check out the reverse emperor room. See what item we get here. Thank you, Brim Bombs, for synergizing with that item. Judas' Shadow is pretty useless, but I'll take it, because why not? I mean, it, it, it just takes away my health, but who fucking cares at this point? Oh, you just got destroyed. Alright, well, let's go seal the deal. I'm gonna kill the eyes, and then I'm just gonna use the Magician card and stand there and watch the, uh, the tears sadly not be able to touch me, because it's hilarious. Oh yeah, I should turn around so they can actually get here. Um. <laughs> I'm literally just gonna not not even gonna do anything. I don't think it can fire brimstone and get until it gets to low health, and uh, it's just not able to deal any damage to me right now. I love it. Good job, fly. That's what I was waiting for. This is the most intense battle you've ever seen. <laughs> I'm not invincible. Like, I don't have, like, Nod Leaf or something, but at the same time, I kind of am invincible. Oh. One, one more of those and she's done. I just hope she doesn't start brimstoning. <laughs> this is so weird. State of Isaac in 2022, am I right? Well, there it is. I barely participated in that fight. But uh, that's it for this daily run. And uh, I guess subscribe to see more since I'll be doing Isaac videos pretty much daily for the foreseeable future. So if you'd like to see Isaac content, then make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Uh, you can leave a comment down below if you want me to see what? If you want to see something specific from me in Isaac, like some kind of challenge or a mod or anything, I'm, I'm down to pretty much try anything at this point. <laughs> um, so yeah, see you guys next video.